It's a rainy day here, and so I thought I'd tell a little story about what I did uh, a few weeks ago. I went down to Leesburg, and uh, I had the windows tinted. And as you can see, there's the window tint. You can see my reflection in the window there. And But I did something else, too, because one of the things that they talked about was that uh, when you're getting your windows tinted, there's a problem with the UV rays coming in on your dash, and uh, I was concerned about that. So, what I decided to do was to take it another step further, and I will show you uh, what we did to this car down in Leesburg. And pay particular notice to the edge line. It's probably hard to see it right here, but they did a great job with this edge line right here, and I'll show you how they did that. That's really, really cool. So let's uh, go back in time for a few weeks and go down to Leesburg and show you what I did. This is a video I recorded earlier in the year, and uh, I've been meaning to put this together, and I just haven't had time. This is some window tinting I had done, and I'm also having a big window tinted also, and you will see the, the results of that in uh, just a little while near the end of the video. It's really amazing uh, what we did here. But anyway, this is Wild Thing in Leesburg, Florida. They've done my 2020 Corvette, and they're doing my 2022 Corvette in this video. And they're very, very good at what they do. Um, but we also have a special thing at the end which shows you uh, what actually can be done. And uh, I'll talk about it when we get near the end here. Uh, here is the care that this guy takes. He's really good. Jasmine's a great guy, does great work, quality, quality work. Like I say, it's the second Corvette he's done for me. And I've liked, uh, his work has been absolutely impeccable. So he's putting, uh, he's got a piece of, uh, uh, tint that he's going to put on the outside of the car and he sprays it with water obviously. I think it's water and soap mixture but he still notice how it, the care he takes in covering everything over so that he doesn't get any soapy water on anything. <laughs> I don't think that's really a big problem but anyway what he's doing he's doing the outline of the outside of the window and then he'll put it up there on the wall like he's doing there and uh, then he'll um, Eventually go in and clean the windows spick and span perfectly clean and then he'll put, he'll attach that, take the uh, protective uh, piece of film that's on there, pull that off of there and then he'll, he'll, uh, he'll put that on the, on the inside of the window. So what he's doing right now is again he's doing the outline of this, of the passenger side outside window. And then once he gets this all cut, he'll put that on that piece of plexiglass that's over to his left or our right. And um, he'll take the protective uh, covering that's on there, he'll peel that off. And then he'll go to the inside of the window, and it's on the inside of the window that he will attach the window tint. This window tint is really, really good. It, um, covers 99% of the UV rays. You don't want that stuff getting in on your car. And I've been concerned about the uh, dashboard on the car too. And I think we have a solution for that today, as you're gonna see in a little bit. <laughs> so anyway, uh, he's getting that piece ready. And he's gonna put that window nice and clean. So he's getting that all just the way he wants it. And that's important. And gets plenty of water on it. Now he's going to take this piece, take the protective coating off of there and spray it down. And then he's going to take that piece and put it on the passenger side on the inside of the window which he's doing right now. Beautiful work, I'll tell you, this guy's really good. And then he's gonna do the 
about the same thing uh, as he swings over now to the uh, other side. And he's now he's filing down the edge so that the edge of the tent and the, the edge of the glass are nice and smooth and get a nice good bond and so that when you index the window, like when you put the window up or you open the door and when you shut the door, the window goes up a little bit, it, it's not gonna get caught, it's not gonna get pulled. Here's some more he's doing the other side now, the passage side window. And by doing this, he really makes it everything work and I've never had a, any issue with any of his tent. So that's really a nice job, a job well done. You guessed it, I'm having the windshield tinted. And he's doing the same thing he did with the, with the uh, side glass on the doors. He puts the tint on the outside and then he cuts it just the way it should be. And now he's putting the, in, the cut piece inside. He's got the windshield all clean. He did all this. I didn't want to bore you with all that extra stuff. But, and he's got all of this going. And he's putting the, it's pretty clever. He's putting it in. By the way, it came out perfect. It's the lightest tint you can possibly get. Very, 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 very light. You can see him right through there. I mean, it's simple. Uh, it's very light, but here's a big thing. 99% of the UV rays will stay off that doggone dashboard. 99%. Bingo, I love it. It's working great. Also, thanks for uh, watching, and I hope you uh, hit the subscribe button and maybe leave a comment or hit the like button. All of that helps, and it helps me continue on to keep doing these videos for you. So thanks again for watching and we will see you on the next video.